EJ for re and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. So what is the goal for today? Uh, very simple. The goal for today is to save up as much money as possible. Okay, that's what that's what we're going for today. And I don't know how far we're gonna get. I'd like to get at least at least half the way there. We'll just have to see because last episode when I bought the when I bought the extra books it put me uh, not in the not in the black it put me in the red. I was actually behind. I was behind on bills. Um, I, I did get a loan paid off, but there was two days of the loan I had to pay for, which kind of stinks, but I did get it paid off after that. Um, I have since paid my bills. Uh, the stock for the store is looking pretty decent and, um, yeah, we're just going to start rocking and rolling. You know, you know, how you know how it goes. All right. So hello from Sweden. Hello, Sweden. Loans are for noobs. Yeah, I know. I couldn't, I couldn't wait, man. I didn't want to do a whole nother day and I was so close to what I needed to do. So I decided to get a loan. I agree. Don't get, don't take loans. All right, 5,400. Sounds good. ABC book. ABC book. Um, I won't share. Oh, there it is. I'm going to keep that where it is. I'm going to keep that where it is. And let's go ahead and open up. And we're going to go ahead. Um, when I was done, if, who here saw last episode? Not last stream, but the actual last episode. Um, last episode, I was debating on how I wanted to rebuild, how I wanted to build out the store after I get my next expansion. And I'm going to be perfectly honest with you guys, I haven't come to a conclusion yet. But what I did was I saved the game and I started moving stuff around to see how it would work. If I have all these, um, if I have all these shelves going this way, they're going to be really, really short shelves. But even if I wanted to keep the shelves the way they are right now, I definitely want to move the... I definitely want to move the registers uh, going this way. And if I do that, this whole line of shelves is going to have to come out. And then I'm going to have to, like, move shelves down. I'm going to have to redesign the whole store anyway. So I'm not really sure what I'm going to do, if I'm going to be perfectly honest. Um, Main Rodrigo, thank you very much for the super what? chat. Good evening, Cage. How are you doing today, my friend? I'm doing good. How are you doing? Darlene Miller re-upped with the Cage crew for six months. Thank you very much. That's a long time, and I appreciate it. Short, do realistic. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I want to do. Some people said that in Walmart, the the um, the what do you call it? The display cases go the other way. But that's a Walmart. That's a very different from a convenience store. I've never seen a convenience store uh, have the shelves the way I have them. And even if I decided to keep the shelves going this way, I would have to redesign it because I got to. I want to turn these guys this way, and then I'm gonna have to move this back. Move this back move this back and it's just i don't know i don't know i kind of wish this store was longer this way like just m make all the expansions go this way you know what i mean that would make me very happy but i don't think they do someone told me that ex this expansion i'm going this way is the last one and then the next one goes over here so that would be a bummer but we'll, we'll see we'll see it's gonna I'm gonna need a large chunk of time. It's not gonna be like a. Hour, it's not gonna be like a two-hour video. Uh, I'll, it'll definitely be a video. A video I'm recording, and not streaming. And it's gonna be a lot of off-camera work. And I'm thinking like I'm gonna need about three to four hours of recording time to do that entire video. Um, Bill and Amanda, how's it going, man? Twenty-three months in a row. Hell yeah, dude! Almost two years. Love it. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Make the whole store into a maze. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that. Um, CVS kind of does their shelves like that. Maybe the dev needs to add a pharmacy too. Yeah, every every um every like you know supermarket I've ever been in, the shelves always go like that. And I think it makes sense because then you could look down the shelves easier as you're walking along, right? This is torture. I want to play so bad, and we are out of state with no computer. Oh my goodness, Rena. Oh, I feel for you. You should put shelves in front of the register like Walmart and Target. Yeah, I think those are like different like size shelves though, and with the shelves I have, might not be a uh, like where exactly would I put them? Like, hey, what's up, man? All right, two fifty. There you go. Have a nice day. I can't wait to play again. <laughs> the thing I miss most in this game is the production section. Oh, sorry, produce section. 
for a supermarket without produce. Yeah, that's true. But I think it's even stranger. No canned food. Like, I think not having canned food is way weirder than not having produce. Wit Pro, thank you very much for the super chat. Good evening, Cage. How's your wife doing tonight? She's feeling better. P.S. Gerbil Dob Sunbon Weeman. Okay, there you go. Gerbil indeed. Um, so yeah, Autumn's doing better. She took she took a personal day from work and just kind of stayed up all night and just relaxed and, un and wind unwound. And um, I let her sleep till two in the afternoon, and she's in a much better mood now. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Main Waruto. It makes you feel any better, Autumn, and I don't go there any anymore. I mean, unless we absolutely have to. There's some things that we have to go to Walmart for, but, um, you know. We'll make sure to go there as least amount of times as possible, just, just because of the disrespect they showed you. Okay. Um, oh, hold on. Hold up. Hey, let's go, man. You the one buying all my toilet paper? You know, guys on a high fiber diet. What are you gonna do? That's looking pretty good. Yeah, really lit up in here. I like it. All right, um, toilet paper. Okay, just the the green toilet paper mostly. Toilet paper for, and we'll do two of those. And it looks like we're gonna need um, whiskey and red vodka. Whiskey and red vodka. Vodka, red, four. Oh boy. Okay. Green tea and black coffee. Tea and black coffee. Whoops. Uh, three more black, wait, five more black coffee? I don't know. Let's just do four more. I'm a-coming. Really? Come on, bro. You do better than that. At least buy a 12-pack. What's the matter with you? All right, have a good day. At least it wasn't one item. Man, people are cheap today. What the heck? Come on, guys. All right, I guess that's enough stuff on the street. No canned food. They got salt, pepper, but no vinegar. Oh, yeah, no vinegar, yeah. Because I, I drink it all. Keep playing dumb games, and I can't see that because it's in the it's over the heart. I'm guessing it means find out. I'm not, I don't even know what that means. All right. Oh, there we go. Damn, bro. Nice. 2.53. Have a good day. Okay, I can see the rest of it. Yeah, keep playing dumb, ga dumb games and find out. Find out what? Have you seen the... Have you seen the... How many people play this game and, and the reviews on Steam? Dumb game? I don't know. Just because you don't like it. Main Marudo. Main Marudo. Thank you for the super chat. Well, now I'm going to be working for a company that makes machines for the military. That makes me so much happier to know I'm supporting my country. Hell yeah, dude. That's awesome. You should, you should feel proud. Yeah. Anytime you see me try to ring people up and, uh, and I'm not, no, I'm not like pointing in the right spots because I'm trying to reach out. Oh yeah, poor miser. What's up with going to work today, Miser? I thought you usually take the day off when you're going to stream. Now you're going to be at work till 8? She's probably not here. I don't know why I'm talking to her. <laughs> All right. All right. There you go. 5325. Have a nice day. Royal S. Thank you for joining the cage crew. Hell yeah, dude. Royal S10, that is. Welcome.
All right, bro. How's it going? Me talking to Scarlet while cooking dinner. Go sit with your sister and watch Cage. Scarlet running to the next room. Yay! <laughs> What's up, Scarlet? Does Scarlet is Scarlet a fan of uh, Supermarket Simulator? That's a dope name, by the way. She got red hair, right? Although I guess you wouldn't know if your kid's gonna have red hair when they're when they're born and you name them. But hey, she does have red hair. Good job. <laughs> I guess you just gonna have to dye it red. <laughs> You're oddly obsessed with this game. It's not odd at all. This game's dope. Oh, I bought the wrong T. Cage, you idiot. Mother effing effers. Mm. Oh, thank you, Pig Hammer. I forgot, obviously. Yeah, if you're not a fan of this game, you might be a fan of Sons of the Forest. I, I'm doing daily, well, almost daily Sons of the Forest. I'm surprised nobody watched the Entrada video, but that's okay. You know, it is what it is. And um, that one demo I did with that water game did pretty well, so people seem to like that. My niece was born with a tuft of red hair just like her dad. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, I didn't know, because, like, I I've never, like, seen a child right after they're born, um, except for in movies. And I saw Rocky too when um, Rocky Jr. was born, and he had a, a head of hair. But I just thought it was because he was, like, Italian. Um, <laughs> I didn't, yeah, I don't know. I thought I thought babies were born, like, bald. Mr. Bellachon? That's a that's pretty close to Mr. Ballin. I like it. Alright, there we go. And let's finish up the day. Guys, how many negatives did I get? I'm gonna say ten. I'm gonna say ten negatives. Can you remove the left label if you don't refill the shelves? Yes, yes, it's exactly correct. Nobody agrees with me on 10, huh? You're all going to be sorry. You're all going to be sorry in a minute. Okay, here we go. 10 it is. Oh, okay. Never mind. Um, Soap Studios. Dude, that person's got a, quite a few right recently. Good job. Why am I getting $4,600? That's what I'm talking about. You buy these licenses, I'm still seeing under 5000 It's ridiculous. Um, Bridget Smith, thank you very much for the super chat. Lurking and working. Be nice to those customers. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think I've gotten used to being nice to the customers. Oh, my goodness. Hummus, beer, dog food. Hummus and beer. Hummus and beer. Hummus and beer. Hummus and beer. I don't even know what kind of beer. Um... 425. 81% of Cage Crew wants you to stream Supermarket Simulator on Saturday. Okay. All right. Looks like it's going to be Supermarket Simulator then. Um, thank you, Cage Crew. I appreciate it. Um, 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 oh, yeah. Beer. Meanwhile, Rudo, thank you for the super chat. It keeps even better, Cage. I also am extremely close to getting off for training... Getting off of training for my local fire department. So becoming an actual active member. It should only take me another two, three, three, two, four months. Wow. Um, you are busy AF. <laughs> All right. So they're both the blue beers. Let's go to 24. Oh, a whole dollar 29. I make a too much stuff going down. Way too many down arrows in this game. I'm just I'm just throwing that right out there. Like, you got like four down arrows today. 
1850. <laughs> was that the last, uh, <laughs> was that the right, last price change? Give me a minute. I got to open my window. It's getting warm in here. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm going to assume that was everything. Whatever the other thing is, I'm going to oh, whatever. Um, I'm pretty sure that, that was four things. Yeah, two beer. The dog food. And what was the other thing? Oh, yeah, and the hummus. No, I, I, I got it all. I done got it all. Let's open it up. Already up to $5,000. Although we haven't ordered yet. Um, all right. Dish, dish soap and dark cleaner. Dish soap and dark cleaner. Um... Okay, ordered that properly this time. Uh, black and orange cereal. There you go. Uh, what is that? That's lasagna. Lasagna and chicken. Lasagna. Four... Chicken six. I don't mind piling up a lot of boxes out there, but at some point I want to bring stuff in. Because I'll forget that I ordered it. I'll be look, 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 like looking around for stuff. It could be in this pile of boxes over here, but I don't remember because I ordered so many things. So it's good to put it away now. I need to go turn on the air conditioner. I think it's kind of warm out. I open the window and I'm still get I'm still warm. Hey, how's it going? Eighty four dollars. Have a nice day. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Hey, how's it going? All right, thirty-eight fifty. Have a nice day. I think I might do a day where I'm just mean to customers all day, just for the lulls. Maybe that'll be my recording I do tonight. When I'm done here streaming, I need to record tonight for tomorrow's episode. And um, maybe I'll just do a day where I'm just like mouthing off the customers all day. <laughs> kind of mix it up a little bit, you know. I don't think you understand my question. If you don't want the workers to refill shel shelves, can't you remove the left label from the shelves? You can't. No, no. I get what you're saying. No, you can't. Um, because you can't move. You can't remove the left label until the shelf is empty. Have a nice day. Hey, what's going on? There you go. Love it. All right. Have a nice day. Has anyone heard anything about an update? I know we just asked, we were just talking about this yesterday, but man, I want an update and I want one bad. I'm in the horse barn, one my, I'm in my horse barn, one my mare is going to, to foil tonight. Not sure what that means. Yeah, yeah, if I'm hot, just wait, I know. Can, Weather here is crazy. And now all my family's all excited about the Royals because it's like their opening day. Now, I don't mind the Chiefs. Well, let me put it this way. I don't like the Chiefs because I'm so tired of hearing about Taylor Swift and her stupid boyfriend. Like, I don't care. Plus, I don't like the Chiefs because they're the New York Yankees of the of the baseball of the football world because they always win, you know? So I don't like the Chiefs for that. But I do like the Chiefs because I want my family to be happy. 
Now the Chiefs have never beaten the the Giants. Um, I'm a I'm a Giant. Well, I don't follow sports too much anymore, but I I used to like the Giants. So, so if I was to say a football team I like, it would be the New York Giants. Um, Robert Beasley, thank you for the five gift memberships. All right. So the 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 Chiefs have never like done anything to the Giants. So like I don't like dislike them except for the fact that I don't I don't care about Taylor Swift and her boyfriend and all that crap. Um. And they win all the time. So they're the Yankees of the of the football world. Although the Yankees buy them buy their way, they used to buy their way to victory, and the Chiefs can't because there's like a salary cap in football. So you know, fair enough. So, but here's the here's the thing with the Royals. The Royals beat the Mets in the World Series in I think 2015. Was that 2015? What year was that? I don't care what year it was. F the Royals. Like, I won't say anything in front of my family because you know respect. I respect them, and I'm not gonna be a you know. I'm not going to be that guy, but seriously, F the Royals. They're the reason my Mets don't have a championship, and it's still been since 1986. Now, I don't, I don't, well, actually, I wasn't following the Mets for a long time. I started following them again last year, and, you know, I'm just so effing tired. 86, how many years ago? Maybe I don't want to know how many years ago that was, um, but yeah, too long, too freaking long, and then, you know, we're in, the Mets are a New York team, and the Yankees were like, Dominating in the nineties. This guy's got to be a Yankee fan. I know it. Um, <laughs> so the Yankees are dominating in the nineties. Beat the Mets in the World Series. Just dominating, dominating, dominating. The Mets still couldn't win a World Series during that whole time. So um, baseball, yeah, you beat my Mets, bro. Like I'm sorry, but never gonna like you. Never. What year was it anyway? It was 2015, right? Alright. Uh, 39. 35. Have it going. I'm an Eagles fan. They were so close to winning last year. Mm. I'm glad you're here supporting my channel. But I do not like the Eagles. I really don't like the Eagles. And... I'm sure you're a very nice person, you know. If you weren't, you probably wouldn't be enjoying my content. But, man, Eagles fans are the worst. Some of them, I guess. And maybe maybe it's a small minority, and they give, like, the rest of the Eagles fan a bad name. But didn't they throw, like, batteries at Santa Claus during a, a Phillies game, like, one time? So, I'm not a fan of the Eagles, but in respect of you being in my stream and being an Eagles fan, I won't, I won't bag on them too much. 197, 75... And it's all in good fun. It's all in good fun. I was... I lived 45 minutes away from Philly before I moved. I don't like the Eagles because they're the... They're in the division with the Giants. And they've got major major rivalries. Same reason I don't like the Cowboys. I, I probably don't care too much about the Redskins because they've never been... Have they ever been good? I don't know. Uh, Maywan Rudo, thank you for the super chat. Cage, it could be worse... It could be the Cubs. They haven't won a game, I believe, in 45 years. No, the Cubs won somewhat. No, the Cubs didn't win. The Cubs didn't win a World Series for like over 100 years, and then they won not too long ago. You know, it's funny. The Cubs like were like I think they were close to the World Series in 2015, and the um, Back to the Future 2 predicted that the Cubs would win the World Series in 2015. So I was kind of rooting for the Cubs in 2015. That would have been awesome. Have a nice day. Wait, um, is uh, Pig Hammer in North Carolina or South? I think he's in North. W what's the North Carolina football team? Don't they have a football team? How do you like the Steelers? Did he say he likes the Steelers? Really? Didn't North Carolina have a team, though? Or one of the cities in North Carolina? Like the Jaguars or the... I don't know, something. Yeah, the Panthers. Yeah, yeah. How come you don't like the Panthers, Pighammer? What's up with that? Family is from Pittsburgh, and Carolina has the Panthers with... Uh, yeah, but still, you don't like the... 
You still like you, you that like were you like a huge Pittsburgh fan when you lived over there? The Giants claim New York though, even they even though they're in New Jersey. They're a New York team, but you're right, they do play in Jersey. They play in the Meadowlands. So do the Jets. Unless they unless they built some stadium since I wasn't there, but since I since I've moved, but I'm pretty sure they yeah, you're right. They're still a New York team though. To be honest, I'm not a sports person. I absolutely hate sports unless I'm playing them, and I find and then I find it fun. I don't really like watching them. Hm, fair enough. All right, what are we gonna order for tomorrow? Cheese. I bleed black and gold. My doctor said it's a disease, but I, uh, but I told Taylor Swift to shut it. Yeah, I don't have anything against Taylor Swift either. I'm just, I don't, I don't care. Like, it doesn't have anything to do with the team, you know. Plus, they win all the time. Like, ugh. Rangers or Islanders? Uh, Rangers. But I was from New Jersey, so really, I should like the Devils. But I like the, I end up liking the Rangers. They had a long time between championships, too, at one point. All right, we need um, we need cheese first. So, All right, guys, how many negatives? What do you think? I'm going to say five. Thank you, Sibs Rive. Uh, I used to be a morning person, not anymore. All right, I'm saying five. Here we go. Who, who agrees with me? Who's agreeing with me? All right, Tony, it's me and you. It's me and you against the world, Tony. Here we go. Ah, oh, damn it, Tony. We messed up. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Do we have a 12? I don't see a 12. Okay, that, that makes me feel better. Nobody got it. Can someone write this down? Musaka, book, beer, and tea. Saka book beer and tea. Saka book beer and tea. Saka book beer and tea. Book beer and tea. Book beer and tea. Book beer and tea. Book. Uh, that is um, Donnie or whatever it's called, the red one. Yeah, let's go at 950. Beer. You ever listen to Bob and Tom show? No. When I was um when I was heavy into sports, um I used to listen to W WFAN the fan. You know? Uh Mike and the Mad Dog and um there were some other guys and I don't remember like anybody else, but I do remember Mike and the Mad Dog. We were, we were able to listen to it at work. We were like in the back, uh, working in the back. Right. Tea. Green tea. Glad I ordered it already. Tea, 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 tea. Eight dollars for the tea. Tea, 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 tea. Let's go ahead and order this. And five. And five. Meanwhile, Rudo, thank you for the super chat. Do you consider this shooting sports sports? Like long precision shooting? I mean, I, I, yeah, but I wouldn't like watch them. Been watching the Y files. Very interesting. Oh, good, good. I'm glad. Yeah. Dude, my what's your favorite Y Files episode? What anyone who watches the Y Files, what's your favorite episode? Because I have a specific episode that's by far my favorite. I'm I'm wondering if anyone else agrees. I just thought it might have been something you might have heard over the years. 
It runs like 6 to 10 a.m. Eastern. Ah, no. Welcome, Zero Sum. Giants and Eagles are the only teams to beat Brady in the Super Bowl. Yeah, the Giants did it twice, right? And the one, the one was they were on a perfect season. I mean, that's oh, it doesn't get any sweeter than that. As as much as it pains me to be a Mets fan, because we just get kicked in the groin repeatedly every freaking every year, all day, every day. As much as the, the 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 Mets pain me, the Giants, man, that Super Bowl where they beat the they beat the freaking Patriots on their perfect season was just. Ugh. And my Papa Smurf for Gargamel. I don't know. Probably Gargamel. Any tips for relatively new player on day 65? I'm selling myself constantly restocking. That's the game. <laughs> That's the game, bro. Um, hopefully, the developer's working on it, though. He knows that this is an issue. And he's going to work on new gameplay mechanics. So just, you know, hang in there. And I will let you know as soon as an update drops. Or if you find out, and I don't know, you let me know. The moon landing was one of the best. My favorite Y files was was the um, Neanderthal episode. So good. Um, my stalkers can keep up. It's not a problem. Oops, sorry. Sorry, not sorry. You barely bought anything. Get the hell out of my store. Oh, wait. I'm sorry. I'm still trying to be nice. Okay. Sorry, lady. My bad. Here's a 10% discount. Any new items I would like to see? Um, Canned food. Oh, boy. Okay. We're going to go with some cleaning products. Uh, three of these. Two of these. Two of these. Hey, how's it going? Man, what's with these people being cheap today? You guys better start. Don't make me... Do not push me. I'm really trying to be nice to you guys, but you're, you're freaking pushing me. I'm going to tell you, you keep poking the bear, you're going to be sorry. Uh, we need, oh goodness, we need every sugar except for the white box. Okay. Well, that makes things easier. I'm gonna come... Are you going to start banning people who buy two items next? No, but I'm going to give an evil eye and put them on notice. I'm going to I'm going to continue with this stream being nice to customers. Hello. Hello, young lady. How are you doing? Have a nice day. Uh, but I think next episode, I'm thinking about just making it all about being mean to the customers. Because, you know, I can't just be nice all the time. That's ridiculous. I'm only human. Uh, 250. There you go. Have a nice day. You're on notice. Have a nice day. Crypt Keeper. <laughs> yeah. Uh, potatoes. Potatoes is really nice. It's always five and five. And then we need Sprite and... Apple juice. Soda. Apple. And let's get some coffee. And some more coffee. Whatever, just buy it all. Buy all the coffee. Look at all this. Boxes of coffee. I'm just going to roll around the boxes of coffee. 
I think my are jealous. The only one I won't be mean to is, um, oops. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, the only one I won't be mean to is Psycho Sid, and that's because he's a psycho. We're good. Need to follow them home and send Joey Bag of Donuts to them. Yeah. Yep. What's one thing you had and one thing you'd like removed from the game? Uh, one thing I'd like removed from the game is the lag. One thing I would like added is someone to take the boxes and bring them in here. That would be my number one thing. Yeah, there's a game like there's a game called Supermarket Simulator that's coming to the PS4 but, or the PS5 or whatever. But I don't I don't think it's the same game. I'm not even sure if it's real. Honestly. Yeah, multiple box pickup would be good too. Hey, what's up? Hey, yo! Hey, yo! It's Psycho Sid. What's up, bro? See, Psycho Sid drops big box. This guy's big time. Alright, this guy's looking good too, man. Yeah. All right, looking good, bro. 170. 25. Have a good day. So you're telling me the game that's coming to PlayStation 5 is this game? You sure about that? I thought someone said that the developer... Someone just, just said... That the developer had said he's had no plans to bring this to console. Have a nice day. Developer said yesterday in the official Discord that this game has no plans to go to console or phones. Okay, good. Well, I was talking on Discord yesterday. Did anyone ask him about the update? <laughs> Did he say anything about the update? Hey, let's go, man. Here you go. Love it. All right, have a good day. I am currently on day 47 and just added the first set of uh, cleaning products. I have two storage guys and two cashiers. It becomes very difficult ordering the, the stuff and putting it in the storage room. Difficult? Like... Difficult, or you mean like repetitive? Something you don't want to have to keep doing. I don't know if I would call it difficult, but yeah, I get, I get it though. It's like, you know, yeah, we're doing the same thing too much here. And like I said, I think the developer knows that. We just have to. It's an early access game, so um, just kind of, kind of tough it through and wait for him to, you know, add more things to the game. Developer just said the other day that it that it is T on consoles yet isn't on consoles yet, but likely come in the coming months. Yeah, uh, it would be weird for the for the developer to say it's never coming to console, or I have no plans to have it come to console. If you say we have no plans currently to have it come to console, people are gonna take that as it's never coming to console, and I would hope he wouldn't want to lead people into thinking this game would never come to console. 
I would be surprised if this game didn't come to console. It seems like it's a perfect fit uh, for console. So I hope he can do it because it would really blow up even more if uh, he could bring it to console. So. Reading the comments online, there's a few harsh comments. Online where? On the Discord or on Steam forums? Or got to be specific. Is there ever going to be multiplayer? Maybe um, keep running a uh, store? Um, I don't know. I don't know about multiplayer. I'd totally buy this game if it came out on the Switch. Yeah, I would too, just to support the dev. The game isn't going to be perfect, guys. It's early access. That being said, it's addictive and fun. And eventually it will be perfection, hopefully. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's early access, so... I don't think anybody's bagging on the game. I just think, you know... We're eagerly awaiting the next update, right? All right, guys, almost 350 people here and only 100 likes. I know you guys are excited about the game, but if you could just take out a, a couple seconds and hit that like button, it would really help. It helps elevate the video, helps the channel get more people in here. Um, and it just takes a second and it's free. So I'd really appreciate it. Shoplifters on the next update. I don't think you should add shoplifters on the next update. I think there's way more important things to add than shoplifters so i hope he's gonna do everything else like not shoplifters i would like to have him give us a little bit more of a bonus when buying licenses i mean i've bought multiple licenses and i'm still at like five run around five thousand dollars every single time like sometimes it'll be 5500 sometimes it'll be 4500 and multiple license bought, and it doesn't really seem to move the needle that much. And considering how expensive the licenses are, like, it, they should be doing a lot more, in my opinion. I want stalkers for the stalkers. <laughs> He's just making so the stalkers bring the stuff in from the road. It, w it wouldn't like be that hard. I don't think it would be. I'm not a programmer. What the hell do I know? But all right, guys, how many negatives do you think we got today? I'm gonna say eight. Yes, yes, I said the amount of Sophie said, or Soph, Soph Studios, so that means I'm going to be right, because that person's always freaking right. All right, here we go, eight it is, oh wow, way off, really dropped the ball on that one, Soph, <laughs> who said 17? Nobody, wow, two in a row and nobody got it. Uh, can someone write this down? Wine, veal, sushi, ground beef. Uh, you know what? I'm going to keep that where it is. Veal. 15. Sushi. And ground beef. Uh, let's go with 850. Mm, 24.50? It wasn't small sushi, was it? Uh, nope. Thank you, guys. Okay, I'm going to start this up and just kind of hang here for a second. I just got to go AFK. I'll be right back.
Okay. Loving this game at the minute. Started today, level 12. Hell yeah, dude. This freaking game's awesome. It's a fun game to, like, watch people play it while you're playing, <laughs> you know? Some games I would watch people play when I'm playing it, like Seven Days to Die or whatever, um, would freak me out because I'd be, like, in a hole digging or something during the night, and I'd be watching someone play it, and all of a sudden, the zombies on there you know, video would freak me out and think that there's zombies attacking me. But that's not going to be a problem with this game. Oh. Any tips on pricing? I usually just go 50 cents or 25 cents up from the market price. I don't, like, concern myself with it too much, to be honest. Are we out of green? Oh my goodness, we're out of almost all the books. Okay, that's a problem. <laughs> not for the green books. I wanted the green books to run out. But the other books, not so much. I have to move around some green books, which is why I wanted them to run out. Totally missed Seven Days to Die streams. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's just... The game's, like, just been played to death. And... Their recent um, alpha releases have been good, but only for a couple months. Like, it's just, they're not offering enough new, you know, in my opinion. Now, if people would watch me play it, I'll figure, I'll, I'll play. I don't mind that game. I can play that game all day, but I don't think people are going to watch it. All right. Colors. Won't share. Brown book. <laughs> I love the books because they're just so cheap to buy. Um, we'll just buy the red books next, I guess. I first started watching Autumn you know playing. That got me hooked. Oh, cool. Old school. Developer just said it's not on PS4. You're reading something fake, my dude. Are you? Did he just say it just now, Pig Hammer? Ask him when the next update's coming out. <laughs> What's up, Mikhail? If I said that right. Not good with names. Oh, a week ago he answered some questions. Okay. Fair enough. Okay, you doing this full time now? Yeah, I have been for a while. Crap, I keep forgetting people reading at my thing. That little thing saying people reading at your register should stay there until you go, you know, do the register. Have a nice day. Sorry you had to wait so long, man. Here's a 10% discount. Have a nice day. Hello, Mr. Anderson. How about I give you... How about I give you the finger and you give me my phone call? Have a nice day. Uh, have a nice day. When you give us another forest gameplay, you mean Sons of the Forest? I just put one up today. If you mean the regular forest, I don't know, man. Not anytime soon. I don't see any reason to play the regular forest, but I think Sons of the Forest is superior in pretty much every way. Let's have it going. The forest episode 12? What do you What do you mean? Forest episode... I haven't done an episode of the forest in, like... Man, like, years. <laughs> 
Have a nice day. Oh, come on, dude. 250. Have it going. How many did? Oh, how many days have I done on this stream? Uh, on this stream? You mean like streams? I'm not, I'm not sure what the question means. Oh, on the, you mean tonight? I, I don't know. I lost track. You guys, you guys want to hear something funny? I have more hours in Supermarket Simulator than I have in, um, in Shrouded. And it's not even close. I have 110 hours in Supermarket Simulator. Have a nice day. Oh, did it say potato chips? Have a good one. Uh, maybe? Did she say they were too expensive or she couldn't find them? Oh no, it was the popper she's looking for. Never mind. Okay. I need some more. Oh goodness, this whole thing is. All right, I'm not gonna be able to run the store tomorrow. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to really order some stuff. Have a nice day. Um, yeah, I give it to the store. Right here is my um, breakfast style. You got bread, cereal, coffee, tea, uh, coffee cakes. Right here is my baking needs. Which is oil, flour, sugar. Over here is um, rice, and then we got condiments: salt, pepper, ketchup, mayo, and then um, also uh, pasta. Okay. Two. Have a good day. Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, I couldn't find honey. I'm out of too much stuff. We gotta. This will be the last day um, until we really get some stuff stocked. Uh, over here is my cleaning supplies. Right here is my books. And then we've got chicken. We've got um, animal food, dog food and cat food, potato chips, candy, chocolate. Um, over here is the alcohol section. Uh, right here we've got uh, meats, fish, fishy stuff like um, sushi and stuff like that. Uh, dinners, eggs, milk, cheese, yogurt, butter. All these are drinks. And then we got stuff, um, you know, in the freezers and everything. I'm out of way too many things. What's up, Miser? Thank you for the super chat. Sol Sol O Phoebe Lay. Sol Sol O Phoebe Lay. Yeah, gas station simulator. It's on my list. It's on my list. Okay. It is really warm in here, guys. I'm going to go turn on my air conditioner. I'll be back in one minute. Close the window. That air conditioner. I do not like... It gets really hot in my room. <sighs> All right, how many negatives, guys? What do you think? I'm going with 17. Damn, vampire, you're reading my mind, bro. There's no way it's going to be under 15. I guarantee you that. All right. Okay. 
Okay. Here we go. 20. All right, who got 20? I don't remember seeing a 20. Are we going to have three in a row where nobody got it right? Wow. No, no, Beltron. Nice try. Nice try, Beltron. I don't blame you for trying. Uh, Susu Sugar Brown. You know, let's go 725. Uh, did I get everything off? The yes, I did. Okay. Trying to think if I want to move these around or not. Uh, hold on. Green books. Green books. Right, I'm waiting for the green books to run out down here. Um, I could move one of these over here. I'll move the pops over here and then just do two. You know what? I'm going to start doing that. These pops, like, also the veggies, man. I need, like, four of the veggies. There's just not enough room back here. There really isn't. That's what we're going to do. I don't see me getting another license anytime soon. So, what I'm going to do is... No, I still want the green pizza boxes there. Okay. All right, hold on. Let me order stuff first. Uh, pizza. I'm okay with two pizza boxes. Pizza doesn't go that fast. Um, one red and two black. One red and two black. One red and two black. Pizza doesn't go that fast. So I'm okay with just two pizza boxes. But the other things, not so much. Veggie, that's going to be four. Green beans, it's going to be four. And we already got the poppers. Okay. So you need two more of something. Um, oh, shoot. I didn't want to do that. Uh, what was that book? What was that book I just erased? It was this one. The Once Upon a Time one. All right, let's set this up. Poppers. See you later, Tony. Thanks for hanging out, man. Uh, more poppers. Ah, uh, veggies. I'm going to take too much room. Um, okay, hold on. I got a better idea. How about... Poppers down here, and then we'll put all the veggies up top. There we go. I don't know, man. I might not get another license until he allows us to make the storage storage in the back bigger. I don't want to, like, move everything to, like, there's a lot of stuff back here that you don't want a half a shelf. Right? Like, this is a full shelf right here. You don't want a half a shelf of veggies. You don't want a half a, half a shelf of poppers or any of that stuff. But there's a lot of stuff you can have half a shelf. Anything that's small boxes, you could definitely have half a shelf. Pizza, you could have half a shelf. Um, you know, there's certain things you can have half a shelf. Cereal is okay at half a shelf. But not these things, man. I run out of them all the damn time.
New episode of the Y Files just dropped. What's it about? Oh, that was supposed to be a green box. Hold on. You guys can all go up there. You go right there. Chicken and potatoes, toilet paper, and bleach take up so much room. Yeah. Very true. What is your restocking strat? I personally find fully stocked shelves, then only restock an item if it falls below one box or less. Um, I just kind of go by what I feel like, you know? Uh, basically, I'll wait until something runs completely out, like this water, and then I'll buy enough to fill it. You know what I mean? So, like, if... Um, Okay, so you see right here the rice is out. I want five of each of those rices. Five of each of the peanut butters. Four of each of the water. Like, I wait until it runs out, but then I I buy a ton of it. Thank you, Too Tall. Oh, it's a contemplation, a, a com, um, compilation episode. That's right. He, I think he's on like holiday or something. He's just like putting together old episodes into one. I was thinking about doing a super cut of this game. It'd be like 12 hours long. <laughs> it probably wouldn't even be all of it either. <clears throat> I'd have to have like super cut part one, super cut part two. All right, what's next? Toilet paper? Uh, Susu. White box. Uh, we need all of the flour. That's three, three and four. All right, look at my bills. Oh, rice, peanut butter. Yes, rice, peanut butter, and honey. Thank you. Rice. Five. Five. Peanut butter. Five. Honey. <clears throat> five. There we go. What else? Um, all the cereals and blue labeled water. Two, four, six. Water, four. All right, it's good enough for now. Let's put some stuff away. If they brought, um, if they brought boxes from the street to the storage room, would be useless, and you would do nothing. I mean, I would, I would order, and I would bring people up. Uh, I wouldn't be doing nothing. I agree. I agree with like. I understand your argument, and I kind of felt that way until I started. All I do is bring stuff in at this point. Like this is all I do. This is ninety nine percent of my gameplay, um, and it's too much. <laughs> so. Forget about the issue with console versus phone Steam. The game seems to have a fork, as in two different versions exist. This game has two different versions? That's weird. The game you're playing is uh, confirmed only by Steam, and it's developed by one person from Turkey. I thought he was from France. Um, using the name Nokia Games. The one from consoles is developed by another company. Okay, do, they, do these companies have anything to do with each other? I don't think you could just make two games with the same exact title. Someone's going to have to change the title. Uh, 
You ordered 30 plus boxes in the street, which negates the 10 ordering. Yeah, I agree. I thought, I thought originally boxes in the streets would disappear if you ordered too many or it would cause lag and it's didn't, it's done neither. So yeah, the whole limit of 10 makes no sense at all. I don't get it. Okay, so they're just two different, two different companies making the same titled game, and one's gonna be on console and one's gonna be on computer. That's really fishy, man. Like, And I was really out of a lot of stuff up front. Oops. Not everyone has supercomputers. Too many boxes might cause lag for some. Also, too many boxes and people will forget what they ordered. Yeah, but they don't have to order more than 10. So that's on them. But for people's computers that can handle it, why do I have to be limited because of someone else's computer? That'd be like saying, well, we got to have low quality graphics because some people's computers can't handle the high quality graphics. You know what I mean? <clears throat> Man, I feel like I'm bringing this stuff in. It's just going off the shelves faster than I can stock them. Normally, I don't like doing this when the store's closed, but, you know, if I got people out there not getting what they need, then, then I am losing money. You, the guy, this guy plays on Steam Deck with no problem with 50 items. So, I don't know. Um, I get what you're saying. I just feel like people with lesser computers have got to order less. Maybe there could be, like, a warning when you go to order more than 10. It says, hey, you know, this could lag out your game if you're on a, like, lackluster computer or whatever. Um, but, yeah. To stick me with ordering 10 at a time and a lot of other people, you know, because our computers, like, are, are better. That, that's not right. Keys is running a top tier computer, but is my 3060 laptop card going to run with minimal lag or is it going to eat my hardware? I, I don't, I mean, I don't know. I don't know a lot about laptops, but I don't think this game feels like it's, it's super like intensive on, you know, power, but I don't know. I could be wrong. <clears throat> Get this man a dolly. I know, right?
Get this man a cough drop. Freaking allergies. Give me one second. I need to get a cough drop. I had to close up my cough, my, my bag of cough drops because the cats were putting their little paws in there trying to get cough drops out. How many hours until Dolly or eight more stalkers? <laughs> I don't know. But because all the, the riffraff in the freaking um, Discord, the developer like doesn't want to talk about updates anymore. Because like some people gave him crap. Which sucks. It really does. Alright, what else we got back here? Um, we need red pasta and cleaning supplies. Pasta. Four. Now these cleaning supplies are perfectly fine buying two at a time. Two boxes at a time on this is fine. Wait, that's not what I need. Okay, I don't need two boxes on those. But if I did, it would be fine. I need these. That's... And I need that. And we're going to go with two more of those. And then... This stuff's all looking good. We're going to need bread. I'm going to order more bread, too. I was kind of, like, trying to get used to only using two boxes of everything, but it, it runs out just way too quick. Miser, thank you for the super chat. It's me. Hi, I'm the problem. It's me at tea, at tea time. Everybody agrees. I'll stare directly at the sun, but never in the mirror. It must be exhausting. Always rooting for the anti-hero. What the hell are you talking about? You absolute maniac. They give you the super chat. Not job. I don't even know what this, what this girl's on about. Uh, let's get blue beer. Blue beer kegs. It's not the box that caused the lag. Um, you have 100 in storage. It's a physics from spawning them in. Probably causes problems. Uh, the dev could just spawn them in batches. It would take a bit more programming. I, I, I've never had issues with them. I've never known anyone to have issues with them. I know people who have mods in this game and order hundreds of boxes that have no issues. So are people having issues? Are you guys having issues or? I'm so confused. I was recommended to watch this video. What the heck is going on? Um, Dabbles, do you know what Supermarket Simulator is or? All right, what was I doing? Oh yeah, ordering more stuff. Uh, let's get scallops, salmon, chicken, and veal. Scallops, salmon. You know what? I'm just going to get six salmon to hell with it. And then chicken. And we get five of that. And veal. I think it's called veal, right? I always forget what it's called. Venison? No, it's called veal. I always forget what it's called. Yeah, moving more than one box at a time. Yeah, exactly. I kind of have issues watching mountains of boxes in the streets. <laughs> Fair enough. Did that person say what if they know what this game is? I'm the chat's I'm having a hard time keeping up with the chat. Or did they just leave? <laughs> they just said what the hell is this? And he just left. <laughs> That's funny. Did you know that you can actually flip cars in this game? I did not know that. I was... Oh, okay, never mind. Read that. Um, I now want a weed shop sim. Well, there's a drug dealer sim, I know. Uh, yep, right 
there. <laughs> you decided to stick around, huh? Okay. <laughs> YouTube's been weird lately. Like, like no joke, dude. Like, I've had it hasn't happened as much lately, but like a couple weeks ago, I was getting some real weird stuff in my my like home screen. Like, like not even like popular videos. Like videos that had like five or ten views. And just, like, I don't know what they were there. They weren't anything I was interested in or anything I looked up on YouTube. It just seemed like the algorithm just, like, went on a, like, a freaking, what is it called? Binger? Binger? I don't know. Bin binger? Is it called binger? Why am I having problems with this word? I really wanted you to enjoy a nice calm stream of Cage ranting at customers. I'm not ranting at customers. Totally nice to the customers, bro. We really ran out of stuff in here, didn't we? Bread! Welcome, Steel. Glad you could make it. Goodness. You're right. I want to be able to carry like five boxes at a time. Uh, do I play horror games? Not really. I tried Phasmophobia. I found it kind of like boring. It was it was horrific how boring it was. Um, <laughs> uh, the Sons of the Forest and the Forest are probably the closest things, but they're more survival horror, which is cool. I got so fed up by moving boxes that I got a mod, uh, which will push a key pushes them into storage. Does it like put them where you have them labeled? Is that how it works? I don't. I really don't want to. I don't want to sign up for stupid Nexus mod. Like, why can't they just have it on Steam? Like every, like all the other games. Well, probably because it's an early access game and he hasn't gotten around to it yet. All right, that's fair enough. Yeah, Seven Days of Die could be kind of horror in the beginning when you're not used to it. Because Nexus Mod has been around for a lot longer than Steam's version. Yeah, but I, I don't want to have to go make an, another account. Like, I have to make a password for every freaking website I go on today. I've got a book of, like, a thousand passwords. And I am so tired of making passwords. Like, I don't want to do it. And even though I might actually have a Nexus account. And guess what? I don't know the password. I'm going to have to go, oh, you forgot your password. Oh, we got to text your phone uh, to prove it's you. And it's just a headache. It's just a headache. If it was on the Steam thing, I could just go on and get it. You know what I mean? Okay. How are the green books doing? I want to get those out of there. I don't think there's enough. I'm going to have to let them sell a little bit more. All right. Let's see if there's anything out here we are low on. Um, oh, blue beer. Blue box beer. Blue box of beer. Blue box of beer. And eggs. All 
No, oh, no, not those. The box. What's up, Kira? Personally, um, I would I wouldn't want to watch if there was mods use, not at this stage in the game. But that's just me, I guess. Yeah, that's another thing. I mean, I'm trying to portray the game as its proper, you know, what you're gonna get. Like if someone's like new and watching me play, maybe they're thinking about getting the game. I don't want to do mods because then, you know, they're not gonna know I'm doing mods. Even if I say I did mods, people aren't gonna hear it. They don't listen. They don't watch every part of the video. Um, so I could say I'm playing modded game until I'm blue in the face. People will still not get it. Which is fine. Um, I need beer too. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I mean, they're just not going to get it. So, and like, I kind of want the, the developer to make the changes to the game that are necessary. And not like, if he sees us playing mods, he'll be like, oh, well, that mod took care of it. I don't think developers think like that, but still, I'd prefer to have the developer fix it. Um... Then mod it. But, yeah. I don't know. Uh, do, 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 do. Now that goes over here. Oh, no room. Okay. It's not even supposed to go there. Damn it. I don't even know what was supposed to go there now. Alright, so there's a book that's supposed to go there. And I don't know which one. Alright. Blue, pink... Orange, white, brown, green. Blue, pink, orange. It's the white one. It's this one. And then we're going to get... Actually, I'm not getting the blue one because I'm trying to wait until things are out. I know the green's out, but I want it to be out for a specific reason. Uh, you know what? I think just a few more eggs and we're pretty good. Taxi driver simulator. I don't know. I don't know about driving around. I don't know if I would enjoy that. But to be fair, I didn't think I was going to enjoy this as much as I did. So. Why do you get rid of the green books? Um, I have green books in a spot I don't want them to be in. So I'm waiting for them to sell out so I can get them into the place I want them to be without having to fire my stalkers. Because if my stalkers will stalk them even when I don't want them to. So I'm going to let them run out. Or almost run out. They probably won't even run out. They'll almost run out. And then once I get them in the place I want them to be, then I can order, you know, six more boxes. Love watching your progress. I still haven't unlocked most of the stuff. I keep one set of empty boxes stacked in the corner in case I need to move anything. Can't wait for the dev the update. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I hope it's soon, man. I really do. But maybe some of the updates he's, he's you know, working on might take longer because they're more substantial updates, for, you know, for all we know. Do you think Seven Days to Die should add some of the modded items to vanilla? Eh. I feel like Seven Days to Die should just add, you know, add uh, legendary armor, special armor, add um, raiders, and then just go gold at this point. Um, their past few updates, and by few, I mean four or five updates, and we're talking like multiple years, because they do almost like pretty much an update a year. Uh, they've been... They've been good updates, but not like they used to be in the past. Uh, the game is not being changed. They're not doing anything to the Horde Knights. 
Um, all the horde bases are all the same. They've been the same for years now. People will find a little thing here and there, but for the most part, they're basically all the same. And like, if I was going to go back and do another, uh, you know, series on Seven Days to Die, and I have considered it, like I, I'm almost like ready to just turn the horde knights off. Like, what do we, what do we want horde knights anymore? Like, you know, the bases are all the same. We figured it out, and they haven't made any changes to them in in half a decade. I bet it's been like five years. I mean, like they've done nothing to the hordes. All they've been doing, and I'm not saying this is bad, I'm just saying, all they've been doing is graphics, performance, and and things like, um, I did like the book, the way they set up the books in Alpha 21. I love the books. I, I think it's a really cool mechanic, and I do enjoy it. But, it, you know, it had nothing to do with Horde Knights, and it was a couple months, months worth of content, where there are other updates, you know, I'd be playing for six months, a year, without even worrying about it. What's up, Jack? Uh, Cage, as long as it's one of the elongated boxes, you can use an empty box to take your books out. Yeah, yeah, I know. I know. I just didn't really care that much. Roaming hordes are awesome and keep you on your toes. Roaming hordes? What, in vanilla? Or are you talking about mod? Because the roaming hordes, if there's roaming hordes in vanilla, I don't even remember... Uh, they were like mediocre to say the least. I I played with a roaming horde mod that um Kodo set up for me, and that was devastating. <laughs> that was devastating. Man. You get a roaming horde, like you try to do a quest and you get caught in a house. I think I died on like episode one of that series. Top three survival games, the best with uh, that are the best with friends. Seven Days to Die, Sons of the Forest, and. Would be one that. Um, let's give Conan some love. Nobody loves Conan. Let's give Conan some love. Yeah, Conan. All right. <sighs> if the order more. Really like to start this day. I've been watching Jawudo play demolishes only. It's been insane. Um, every non-animal zombie is a demo. <laughs> That's funny. Ah, uh, salt and pepper. I thought I was done. Salt, pepper, beer. Man, it's still the freaking... Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Okay. We're almost there, guys. I'm telling you. We're, we're, we'll be opening up shortly. Pepper. Beer. I don't know how many of these I need. I'm just ordering five of each. I don't care. What was the other thing I needed? Oh, yeah, eggs. You know what? To hell with this. Oh, never mind. I'll do five, I guess. I was going to do ten. <laughs> You are almost broke. Yes, I am. Well, no, I'm not, because look at all this money I have in the back-end product. When you, um, <clears throat> when you, like, <clears throat> excuse me, when you determine a person's wealth, especially someone who owns a business, you don't, it's not just how much money they have in the bank, it's, like, their assets. <laughs> you're, st <laughs> you're still basically the same balance when the stream began. <clears throat> no, I'm not, because I've got tons and tons of assets. I, You know, one thing I'd like them to put in this game, and they'll never be able to do it because of copyright issues, but I would love for them to put, like, your ability to put arcade units in your store. Like, just on the sides and everything. And, like, you should be able to play the arcade units, and then a mini game of that arcade unit pops up. Like, I want to be able to have a Donkey Kong machine and go up to the Donkey Kong machine and play Donkey Kong. And he'll never do it because Nintendo would sue him into oblivion, but, um, yeah. <laughs> hey, 
Pete Pullen. I read that in Jack Sparrow's voice. You should have you should have ended it with a darling. Keep telling yourself that, darling. <laughs> At the beginning of the stream too, I was um I was really poor on stock. Like it was almost empty back here because the, the last video I made, I bought that last license and I spent like all my money. Like I remember I didn't even have money to pay off my um uh to pay my bills. So Yeah, Tetris would be cool. <laughs> You pay your bills? Um, somewhat recently. Subsistence sucks. You can't level up quick enough for me to even bother watching it anymore. Wait, who said anything it's about subsistence? <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> you can't level up quickly enough. Quick enough for me to even... Wait, you don't level up in subsistence. I'm confused. I want people to take the stuff in from the, from the street and put it on these shelves. I also want a bigger storage room. Actually, I'll take a bigger storage room first. No, that's not true. Take them in off the streets. But the, second, the bigger storage room is definitely second. What are people... Uh, yeah, I already read that. It will automatically pay your bills if you forget. What the hell is that? That's not how real life works. If I don't pay my credit card bill, they, they put a late fee on it. Storage room upgrades is what I'm most looking forward to. Other than that street stalker. I, I, would, I would take the street stalker first, honestly. Who played Galaga in the cabinets? Dude, I have a an arcade one-up machine. Uh, it's a um, Pac-Man one, but it also has Galaga. I gotta I gotta work about it. There's so many things I wanna do. Like for real. I want to work on my arcade my arcade room. I have I have like a bunch of arcade machines. They're all arcade one ups, they're not like the real ones, but they're like three quarter scale, so they're still pretty good. Um, but yeah, um, I want to do that. There's like a bunch of other games I want to play. I'm not going to mention them because I might want to do videos on them someday. And if I do, I want them to be a surprise for you guys. Uh, it's just, but you know, here I am streaming and having a great time doing it. All right. We're now open people. Why settle? Let's get both more storage and box boy in the same update. I agree, but I'm just saying, like, if it's one or the other. What's Galaga? Miser. Miser, I, you better get some rest before you come visit. Because I am going to have a lot of fun activities for you. And playing Galaga is going to be one of them. When I was able to catch a stream... Had family stuff tonight and just settled in with my son to watch a bit. Well, welcome, uh... I have no idea how to say your name. Gem... Gemry? I do want to set up some orders, uh... While I wait. But nothing is out. I'm going to have to break my my rule of not ordering stuff unless it's out. Um, so how about three blue cat food and one dog food? One, two, three. One, how about candy? Three, and chocolate.
See, once you've stocked, you gotta keep it stocked. Damn, lifeless. <laughs> it's rough. I've heard of it before. Something about mentioning it in pixels. Oh, so you saw it in a movie? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ooh, what, what are you talking about Interview with the Vampire for? That's a great movie. It's probably my second favorite vampire movie after Lost Boys. Let's get... Let's go wait on customers. Hey, what's up, man? How's it going? Back on the register. Fastest register in the West. How's it going? Hello, young lady. How are you doing? Alright, very nice. Somebody's gonna get plastered tonight. 171, 25. Have a good day. Do not hate on Pixels, kids. That movie was funny. No, I'm not. I'm just sad that Someone only knows Galaga from a movie. But, you know, that's fine. Understandable. Have a nice day. There's a lot of stuff a lot of people know about that I don't know about. I remember getting yelled at one time because I didn't know who, um... Oh, God, I can't remember his name. He's like a big YouTuber. Um... Jap Se Jack Septicai. I remember I was making Minecraft videos, like, back in the day. And I was like, someone said Jack Septicai, and I knew who it was. And they're like, I got yelled at for not knowing who it was. Also, when I first saw the name PewDiePie, I called it Pie Die Pie. I was like, who's Pie Die Pie? And people are yelling at me about that too. So the 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 internet will educate you with prejudice. What's up, oh man? I I know now who Jacksepticeye is. I didn't know back then. Who's your favorite wrestler? Ooh, tough call. I don't know, because I, I used to like certain wrestlers, but then I know behind-the-scenes things, and I don't like them anymore. Um, Kevin Nash comes to mind. Scott Hall. I probably like... Yeah, I like Scott Hall more than Kevin Nash, for sure. Yeah, let's say Scott Hall. R.I.P. Hi, Cage. I am watching Supermarket Simulator. You, you sure in heck are. Welcome. Someone asked how I ring up so fast. You just mashed the, le the left mouse button. Uh, 235, 75. Have a nice day. Ultimate Warrior? Okay. My favorite wrestler was an oldie. Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know Jake Paul was until he started fighting boomer boxers. Yeah. Yeah. I heard about Jake Paul, like, when he started boxing. And then, like, the whole Tyson thing is just crazy. Have a nice day. You love The Undertaker? Yeah, The Undertaker was awesome. Andre the Giant? Nice. Uh, looked like Tim Tebow? Okay, fair enough. Um, Museum Grack Heads. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. Did you see the recent rock run in W? I don't watch wrestling anymore. Wrestling is is a shell of its former glory. Some of it's not their fault either. Like, no more blood, no more chair shots. I get it. I, I really do, but man, like, ugh. I grew up in the Attitude Era. I can't watch it today. Like, just can't do it. Plus, I don't have enough time. Uh, 45, 25. Have a good one. Hello, young lady. How are you doing today? 
All right, exact change. Love it. Have a good day. You met The Undertaker? Yeah, The Undertaker seems like a cool dude in real life. Yeah, Mick Foley's cool, too. Oh, you love the Dudley Boys? Yeah. He would always powerbomb people through tables, and then he'd go into, like, a like a trance. <laughs> Freaking Dudley Boys. Those guys are nuts. Your Minecraft videos are so thumbs down. I know. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry for the time you had to spend watching them. Uh, 78, 75. Have a good one. Mick Foley is a legend. He was in the, uh, he was in it back when they cut. Yeah. Yeah, when they bladed. You handle the trolls well? No, nah, it's not a troll, man. It's, it's for real. My, my early Minecraft videos were really bad. $10. Have a good one. How's the store going? Is your store square now? Uh, not yet. I have to save up $52,000. It's going to take a little bit of time, unfortunately. What about legendary bands? My favorite bands? I like 70s, 80s, and 90s, and some early 2000s. Uh, my most recent favorite band is Slipknot. I didn't listen to Slipknot when they were big, which is really weird because it was right in my time. You know? But um, I just, I don't know, I never listened to them. Uh, so they're my favorite now. I also like Ginger. Um, oh, what else? What else? What have I been listening to recently? Uh, I don't know. How about Guns N' Roses? Um, Motley Crue? Uh, some of the 90s stuff doesn't age well, right? Is it just me? Or does 90s grunge not age well? Am I just, am I crazy? I mean, let me, let me know, guys. Because I was, I was big time into grunge. I was in a band, like, just playing grunge music, like, n mostly Nirvana. And we were, like, it was the only music that mattered to us, you know? And now when I go back and listen to it, I'm like, eh. Like, going back and listen to Nirvana, like, I study Nirvana. I read, like, all their books. I learned all their music, like, intensely. Um, all the, like, the lyrics and everything. I, I've read books about how Kurt Cobain wrote his music. And, um, eh, yeah, yeah, not a fan of it now. Yeah, Alice in Chains is still good. Alice in Chains holds up. Um, but, like, I guess maybe it's mostly Nirvana. Maybe I just, maybe I listen to Nirvana too much and I just got sick of it. I don't know. That could be it. Uh, Soul Asylum. I don't recall, I know the name. I don't recall their music. Um, yeah, I don't know. A lot of that stuff. Um, I was listening to some Stone Temple Pilots. Uh, you know what else I don't like? Uh, the early 2000s bands. Like the, Wasn't there two bands in the early 2000s that teamed up with um, Slash from Guns N' Roses? There was the one with um, with the guy from Stone Temple Pilots. And wasn't there one with the guy from uh, Soundgarden? And I've been listening to that those songs. And those songs are... I, don't, I think they're pretty generic. Generically bad. Like... I remember back in the, like, the early 2000s, I was like, oh, these are pretty, you know, these are pretty cool. I love Slash, but then I listen to them now and I'm just like, ugh, like, it's not good. Just kind of generic, I guess is the word I'm looking for. Yeah, Velvet Revolver. Yeah, that was one of them. Yeah. Yeah, and Audio Slave. Yes. Yes. Now, I didn't listen to a ton of their stuff. Maybe they did do a lot of good stuff. I'm just talking about like their hits, you know? All right. Guys, how many negatives do you think we got today? I'm going to say five. Okay. Here we go. Oh, nine. Okay. Um, Steven, the, the bass man. Good job, bro. You called it. You called Oh, can someone write this down? Mashed potatoes, flour, moussaka, and potato chips. Let's go with four fifty. Um, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that too. Coffee miser. 
Damn you, Miser. Potato chips, moussaka, and flour. Alright, what kind of flour? Uh, the red flour. Okay, thank you. Seven twenty-five, and the lasagna that's not lasagna. Uh, okay, well, now nah, let's bring that down to fifteen fifty. I was not a huge fan of Led Zeppelin or, um, or Van Halen. Those are the two that when I tell people, they're like, what? <laughs> but yeah, I just never got into either of them. Uh, we need blue beer, and we'll take a little bit of the other beer, too. Beer. Blue. Oh, that's perfect. Three. Potato Pops. Didn't I buy like four of those? Yeah, I got three boxes right there. Are they out? No, they're not out. I don't know if you guys are. I don't know if you guys are, oh, wait, was Potato Pops one of the rules? That cha uh, one of the um uh, things that changed? And I missed it? Hey, <laughs> Gidget, thank you for the super chat. Potato Pops! Thank you, guys. Good call. I'm gonna go with 975 on these. Um, I like Lincoln Park. I'm not like I wasn't gaga over them like a lot of other people were, but I thought they were pretty cool. They had their time. Um uh, mm, 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 mm. Brown beer. Three will be fine. Mm, we need toilet paper. I'm a big band fan. Don't hate me. No hate here. We don't hate on this channel. Um, black vodka. And blue coffee. Yeah, Disturbed is cool. Did you ever see um did you ever see the live version? The guy from Disturbed did uh Sound of Silence. I think it was on like one of the late night shows. Unbelievable. I do have a whole alcohol section. It's right here, buddy. Look, this is where you go to get plastered. All right? I, my my thing is I I go on YouTube and I watch people react to music that I've I know about, you know. It's a lot of fun. Nightmare Revisited? No, I don't know what that is. Yeah, what's with all the <coughs> what's with all the freaking grunge people OD on heroin and blowing their heads off and stuff? Like, what the hell, man? Like, ugh, makes me sick. Oh, rustlers died too. I mean, that's part of why they don't want people taking chair shots anymore. You know, I guess they're still allowed to take steroids though. I don't know. They probably have like wellness checks and stuff, but. I think there's ways around that. Yeah, Def Leppard was awesome. 
I stay up way later than I should watching people react to music and movies for the first time. Paper mushrooms, you are my spirit animal. Because that is my... That's that's why I don't go to bed till 5 o'clock in the morning every freaking night. It, the best is, like, watch people react to, like, um, Fight Club. That's a good one. I like watching um, uh, hip-hop heads react to, like, like, rock or heavy metal music. That's always fun. I've watched so many, like, people, like, love hip-hop, like, turn into metal heads. I mean, they still love hip-hop, but they also love metal, you know, which is awesome. And I don't mean, like, super metal. I mean, anything. Anything that's not hip-hop. I guess rock and roll, you know. Like I said, Guns N' Roses, Def Leppard, um, Motley Crue... Uh, oh, you want to see something funny? Watch Google or go on YouTube when you're done watching here and what and um, YouTube search on YouTube uh, Pantera in live in Moscow reaction. Those are awesome. I love watching people react to that to that um, domination performance. You ever think they'll fix the stalkers? Mine keeps Blair witching the boxes. Um, it happens to me too, but not not that often. Um, I mean, I, I'm assuming we'll fix them at some point. He's probably working on it, but... Um, I am not a fan of Metallica. I mean, I, I understand that their music is good, but I did not like the bullshit they pulled with Napster back in the day. It kind of bothered me. So, I'm not a huge fan of Metallica. I, I respect their music. I loved uh, Master of Puppets in um, uh, Stranger Things. I think that was fantastic. But like sometimes, sometimes a sometimes a musician will say something that just, or do something that just aggravates me so much that I have trouble listening to their music. I know that's silly, but you know. Yeah, they're they're extremely talented. I don't think that could be denied. All right, we need white cereal. Check out the Brad and Lex. They really get into the music, and one of them I hear Brad and Lex. What I don't know the names. What do they look like? I know what they look. I know what the reactors look like, but it's hard though because. There used to be so many more music reactors on um, on YouTube, but like the, the record labels just shut them all down. It's like really hard for people to react to music on YouTube. Back in uh, when Napster was hot, people were downloading tunes of albums they would never buy. Yeah, I'm not saying like I'm not saying Napster wasn't a problem, and I guess I understand, but like. It just bothers you. You're a multi-million dollar, like you're all multi-million dollar, like you have millions and millions and millions of dollars. And I get it. It's, I don't know. It's just, I'm not even saying it was, I'm not saying it's right. I think, I think Metallica probably had every right to do what they did. And I, I, you know, on one hand I get it, but on the other hand, like when is it enough? You guys are still making tons of money. It's not hurting your bottom line. People are still going to see you buy your shirts. They're going to see you in concert. People are still buying your stuff. I don't know. It's just, if someone said cage, come on, it's their property. They have every right to do what they did. Then okay, I, I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying it rubbed me the wrong way. That's all. Do they have like funky hair, paper mushrooms? Open. Okay, here we are. We're stocked. Put the whole store on sale. I don't know about that. That doesn't sound like a way to make money. <clears throat> Cage, did, um, did you work out... The auto pricing mod odd numbers appearing at the checkout. 
Wait, what? <laughs> Did I like Kiss? Um, I'm not a fan of Kiss. I, I don't dislike them. I think, you know, they weren't really my thing, but they had some, uh, they had some catchy hooks. I like that one Kiss video where that guy's like, what do you want to do with your wife? <laughs> that shit cracks me up, man. All right, guys, I'm open. I'm open over here. Don't ignore me this time. You hurt my feelings. Mom. Oh, I never did the green book thing. Crap, I forgot. Okay, hold on. We're going to do that now. Totally forgot. You guys got me talking about... Beak? What the hell is Beak? What the hell is Boo? Come on, Cage. Get your head in the game. Uh, it was the green book, right? I'm just going to buy ten. Oh, that, you're right. That was Twisted Sister. I'm sorry. That was funny, though. <laughs> Can't believe I got them mixed up. Yeah, the other guy had, like, would have blood in his mouth and, like... What else did he do? He had blood in his mouth and he had a long tongue or whatever. Gene Simmons. Alright, we can't put this down yet. We gotta put this off. There we go. Hold on. I'm gonna come. What's up, my man? How's it going? Some cheese and chips. Love it. Have it going. I probably should have ordered so many of these. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> Alright, well, whatever. <laughs> What's everyone's favorite music video of all time? Hey, how's it going? 63, 50, 60, 1, 2, 3, 75. There you go. Have a nice day. What's up, man? How are you doing today? All right. Well, exact change. Love it. Have it going. I need a wholesale meat department? Okay. How many more cash re re register ring-ups do you need? Been watching the series, but I just skipped some of the episodes and watched live. Haha, <laughs> loving the series, man. Um, I don't need any more. I'm doing this for fun. I guess people seem to, like, enjoy my interaction with the customers. I have seen the mods out for the game. I don't use them, though, because I don't like Nexus mod. Damn it. I hate that I put that up there. Where can I put this? Right here. So what the hell book was that? Oh my goodness. I, ah! So annoying. I wish I could just lock a shelf. Like, so I can't possibly put the wrong thing on there. 156, 25. Have a good day. Smooth Criminal by Alien and Farm. That's a great music video. Have a nice day. I saw them do it live, too. Not, like, live live, but I saw them do a live version on YouTube. And, um, yeah, it might be, it, like, they're really good. All right, the best music video ever made was Thriller. Just so you guys know, that was the right answer. Um, but, you know, that's okay. Hey, how's it going? Oh, someone's getting plastered tonight. All right, have a nice day. He's, this guy's coming to me. I can see it. One dollar. Have a good day. I think the grocery store would make a killing on a whole sale meat department. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> Thriller was corny, and in no way was that meant to be corny. Thriller was not corny. Thriller was awesome. You're the first person I've ever heard say anything bad about the Thriller video. 
Oh, goodness. Well, you know, it is what it is. We've got almost 400 people here, so bound to get someone with a hot take. <sighs> okay, books. I need to find out what book I messed up on. Green, pink, orange, white, brown, green. It's the green one. Hey, how's it going, guys? All right, looking good. Damn. That guy's dropping some big bucks. Have a nice day. What's up, Sweater McGee? All right, 52.75. Have a good day. Orange cherry pie. Eh. I was not a fan of it. I mean, it was, I was a fan of it, but I wouldn't call it one of the greatest music videos. Now, if you want to talk about a Warrant music video, um, how about we talk about Uncle Tom's Cabin? That was an unbelievably good video. All right. There you go. Have a nice day. Thirty-seven twenty-five. Have a good day. Holy moly! This lady's going nuts. Two twenty-one. That's what I'm talking about. Eight fifty. Have a good day. All right. 142.25. Have a nice day. Um, 18. Have a good day. One sixty-seven twenty-five. Have a nice day. Hello, young lady. How are you doing today? Nine dollars is your change. Have a good day. <laughs> it's Psycho Sid's brother in a Christmas sweater. They're trying to fool me. I got a lot more people on my line today. One forty-eight seventy-five. Have a good one. Once upon a time. Why would you need three of the same book? Have a nice day. Maybe someone's got three daughters and. And he's going to their house like he's their like their their uncle or something, and he's gonna get each of them the same book. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Let's bring the rest of these in. Now, it, I know it looks like I didn't make a lot of money today, but I did. And I don't mean today, I mean in this stream, but I did. There's a lot of product in the back. Um, again, I wish there was like some kind of like um, number to say how much money worth of product I have in the back. That would be pretty helpful. But we've got a lot of product back here. I mean, just a lot. We're still going to have to order a couple things here and there, but we're pretty, we're pretty stocked. All right, so we're going to need Moussaka. M O U. You we're gonna need four of that. We're gonna need what else did I look at just now? Oh yeah, toilet paper. Four of those. Okay, that's all looking good. Um, we're gonna need pink and blue alligator books. All right, guys. How many negatives do you think we got today? I'm gonna run to the I'm gonna run to the bathroom, and uh, I can't wait to see when I come back. I've got my own number, but I'm gonna I'm gonna wait until I get back.
Okay. How many did I say? Oh, I didn't. I didn't give a number. I'm gonna go with twelve. Ah, oh, darn it. All right. Who's for? Oh, look, Murfkins. Murfkins right out of the gate. Ain't playing no games. No games, Murfkins. That's your new name. All right. We need mayo and craft flour. Mayo. Uh. Two seventy-five and mayo, 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 mayo. Ugh. Go with eight seventy-five. I don't know what was in this, so I'm just gonna put it all away and then order some more. Go. Looking good. So, people in chat, I'm debating tomorrow. What do you think? How many people here would show up to watch Sons of the Forest if I decided to do Sons of the Forest? I think about trying to mix it up a little bit. It would be one. It would be an episode. It would be like an episode in the Sons of the Forest series. It wouldn't be multiplayer. If not, I'll just do this again. You guys, I'm um, tired of seeing me ring people up. I could just open the store now. And don't bother me. I just ring people up to give you guys something. You seem to enjoy it, but yeah. I'll do some ordering and just keep ordering for the time being. All right, red pasta. Um, blue cleaner. Pasta. Cleaner. And then we need two of these. And... freaking guy I'd have to restart the game I mean there's other ways to fix him but I would restart the game to fix him let's do two more wine it was the same time this stream started 6 uh, six p.m. Um, central time All right, man, we go through a lot of Sprite, dude. All right, he's Sprite and Muscle Milk. Soda. Milk. And we'll just do um these as well. Uh, six chicken. Two of these, two of these. What happened to Myth of Empires? Um, two things happened to Myth of Empires. Lack of interest from the viewers. And the main thing was the game was like, would not work with my game capture um, on OBS. And I could use display capture, but I, I didn't feel comfortable using display capture. So, you know, they got to fix their shit, man. Like, you know, I mean, if people if people watched it, I could have got over it. But those two things together just really soured me on it. Oh, yeah, I am store level 83. I think store level 90 is the last time I get something.
I wish I knew when we get the next update, but the developer doesn't talk about it anymore. Because, um, people got uppity in Discord. It's a shame. Kicking boxes of wine all over the place. Come on, chicken. Chicken's the worst. And too big, man. It's too freaking big. Let me carry like four boxes, please. Pretty please with sugar on top. I'm gonna do three apple juice and three orange juice. I'm not gonna wait for them to run out. Uh, three, I said. Three. Yeah, they should add a dolly. Yeah, that'd be that'd be cool. Hummus and tuna. Mm. Oh, steak. Steak. You know what? Give me six. Let's just fill it up. The hell with it. Hey, um, 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 um. White labeled water. Two. And then, what was the other thing? Um, Diet, Diet Coke. And then, that red, that red soda. And, I'm just going to get some of these. Ham. Damn it, nine o'clock. I was trying to beat nine o'clock. Son of a biscuits. Do you ever pop a Slayer tape in to your Teddy Ruxpin? <laughs> no, I can't say I do. A lot of people are wondering if the um, shoplifter is going to steal the boxes off the um, off the street over here. They better not, because like I don't have to babysit those boxes. It's, it's tedious enough as it is. Yeah, can we get can we get another round of likes, please? 
If you're new here and you haven't liked the video yet, please like it. It really helps a lot. I would appreciate it. They need a Chicago edition in this game. What do you mean a Chicago edition? <sighs> oh, deep dish? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That'd be my favorite kind of pizza, I think. Like, any pizza you have to eat with a knife and fork, that's what I'm talking about. Can anybody guess what I think of? And this is a deep cut. If any of you get this, I will be absolutely shocked. Can anybody in the in the comment section tell me what I think of when I hear the, the word deep dish pizza? Nobody's going to get this. I can guarantee you nobody's going to get this. There. Nobody's gotten it yet. <laughs> hey, oh, shut up. <laughs> Guys, you're never going to get this. And I don't expect you to get it. I'd be absolutely shocked if anyone got this. All right, I'll give you a hint because this is so unfairly questioned. Deep dish, deep dish, um, Chicago pizza reminds me of a scene from a TV show. The A team? <laughs> nope. Nope. The question is, when I personally, me, and a lot of you guys probably don't know me very well, so that's why I'm like saying this isn't a fair question. But I'm wondering out of all the people that know me, if anyone could guess this, what do I personally think of? What, what pops into my head when I think of deep, deep dish pizza? And it is a scene from a TV show. And no, nobody's gotten it yet. We're not going to do the guest thing because I want you guys to try and guess that. $5,800. Rice, coffee, chips, ice cream. Rice, coffee, chips, ice cream. Rice, coffee, chips, ice cream. Rice. Coffee. Chips ice cream. Coffee. Chips. Oops. Well, it doesn't matter. There's only two chips, so. It wasn't chips. It was Pops? Okay. Pops, Pops, Pops. Thank you, guys. Mm -hmm. 
And ice cream. Ice cream. Oh, damn it. Let's go 525. I don't even know if this is the ice cream. It's good. Six. All right, let me see if anyone got it. I don't see anyone that said it. So does anybody, has anyone here seen Supernatural? There was, um, there was a scene in Supernatural where Dean was meeting with Death. Yes, the Grim Reaper, Death, in Chicago. Because Death was about to wipe out Chicago with like a, I think it was like a hurricane or something. And they sat down in a, in a Chicago pizza place and had a, had a, shared a deep dish pizza. And I, I know that's super duper like, out there, like what the hell? But that's what it reminded me of. Hey, Camry, you've never seen Supernatural. What the hell? Because you're working too much. That's your problem. No, I don't want. I don't want to get another license. I don't want because it'd be too much trouble trying to fit everything in the back room. Supernatural is one of the best TV shows ever, especially in the first five seasons. It kind of fell off there, you know, when they when um they lost uh, Kripke, but still, like, love that show. Did not watch Supernatural either. Same reason, too much work. Fair enough. Well, Supernatural was supposed to. The last season of Supernatural was supposed to be season five. And that's when Eric Kripke left the show. But it was too popular, so they kept it going. And, you know, it was all right after that, but it was never the same. Did they do an episode on Bigfoot? I don't think so, but they did do an episode on... Uh, what was it called? A Windigo? Which, you know... It reminded me a lot of like if it was if they were gonna do a Bigfoot episode. Uh, Windigo is actually the second episode of the whole show. Why did I order that? Weird. I have watched the boys. Boys is phenomenal. And it's got Dean Winchester in it now. Yeah, Shameless is really good. Shameless kind of fell off towards the end, too, but um, it was really good for a long time. I wonder when they're coming out with season four of The Boys. We should probably order some butter. Just It takes so long to sell. Like, I don't even bother. I guess I will. Get like four of them. Oh, we need hot sauce. Maybe some ketchup too. Nah, just hot sauce. June 13th for the fourth season of The Boys. It's been a long time, hasn't it? Feels like it's been a long time, like longer than it should have been. I have never seen Prison Break. Can't wait for the Fallout TV show, though. It's either going to be a smash success or a crash and burn. Yeah, there's no, there's going to be no middle ground. So there's no way I'm going to get to 50... Four thousand dollars for next episode, but I will. I, I think I'm gonna do an episode where I'm just nasty to the customers. <laughs> just let it go, just for one video, you know.
There's not a lot of good TV out anymore, is there? Like, I can't... I can't think of anything I want to watch. Breaking Bad was OP, but went downhill the last season. Oof. You're the only person I've heard say that it went downhill last season. Breaking Bad last season was phenomenal. That whole show was top-notch from beginning to end. Oh, Bleach and Yamo. And let's also get some shampoo. But they made a Twisted Metal TV show? The Wire was pretty solid. Yeah, The Wire was interesting. I kind of watched the whole thing. I binged the whole thing, and I don't remember not liking it, but I also don't really remember anything about it. I was just kind of like, I don't know, just, you know, cops and robbers, cops and bad guys, you know, just kind of whatever. TV shows are not getting enough money these days? I don't know. I feel like a lot of, I mean, Rings of Power got a trillion dollars, and it sucked. <laughs> Absolute, like, dog feces. Rings of Power. Oh my. Oh my. What they what they did to Token Token's material was a, a, an abomination. I hate everything. <laughs> All right, let's just take this. Um, alligators and black book. Book. Alligators and the black book. Um, pink book, orange book. Orange book, pink book. And then... Blue book and colors and won't share. Book won't share and colors. There we go. How far can you walk around the neighborhood? Um, I'll tell you what. I'll show you when today's over, if I remember, which I probably won't. So keep reminding me. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to bust my butt next episode and get as close to 54,000 as I possibly can. And then the episode after, I want to get that expansion that's going to make my store square. I'm going to need a lot of time, though. Like, a lot of time for that episode. Um, Gidget, thank you very much for the super chat. I don't see any Wombat books. Do you have that one? Wombat? What? I only know it by color. I don't, like, I don't read them. The surprise vintage Wombat is yellow. Yeah, right here. Thanks for looking out, though. Appreciate it. Oh, we haven't talked about freaking uh, Cobra Kai, man. How freaking unbelievably good is that show? Just ridiculous. Cobra Kai is the TV is is the supermarket simulator of TV. It has no right to be that good. No right. I, it doesn't make it. It defies logic. It defies reason. How do I get my thumbnails for the game? Um, I use ChatGPT.
I haven't watched a bit. How many books now? Uh, 12 books total. If you guys have ever watched The Karate Kid, especially if you watched like the whole trilogy, one, two, and three, you will absolutely love Cobra Kai. And if you haven't watched Karate Kid, what what are you doing? Go watch The Karate Kid. Go watch Karate Kid 1, 2, and 3, and then start watching Cobra Kai. Boring, now great when I kid Cobra Kai is dated Z. I'm not sure what that means. Is that a sentence? I'm not sure what they're saying. If you're saying Cobra Kai is boring, then I don't know, I don't know what to tell you. That freaking show is legit. Okay, he retracted his message. He's gonna he's gonna write it better so I can understand. Cobra Kai was the true protagonist. You mean um, you mean Johnny? Did you ever watch that? Um, uh, if you guys ever watch, if anyone here has ever seen a Karate Kid, uh, go on YouTube when 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 I'm done streaming. Write this down. Go on YouTube and type in Karate Kid. Uh, Daniel was the real bad guy, and watch the guy's video on that. It's hilarious. Season one of Cobra Kai was good. Kind of lost me at season two. All right. All right. I mean, I don't get it. I think that show's phenomenal, but to each your own. We lived in the best time, Cage. Growing up in the 80s. I know. It's true. Johnny was the victim all along. Yeah, justice for Johnny. I watched a few episodes of Cobra Kai and honestly felt it was boring. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. I don't mean to judge you. Don't, don't feel bad about not liking Cobra Kai. I'm, I'm kind of half kidding. Um, I'm not half kidding. I mean, I think Cobra Kai is a phenomenal show, and I think it's one of the best shows out in the past decade. But if you don't like it, then that is cool. We don't, we don't hold it against you. Okay? How about that? I have watched Black Mirror. That's one I got a little bored with, watching Black Mirror. Kind of like, meh. All right, we need ice cream. And we need green beans. Let's order like 50,000 green beans. No, they're right here. Is that green beans or? Hmm. Okay. Maybe that's the, I don't know what's going on with the green beans. I'll do it. Oh, that wasn't green beans. Wait, was it? It looked like the tag just flipped over to something else. No, it must have been green beans. I put the green beans with the veggies. I bought Supermarket Simulator, Simulator yesterday after watching you. I already got 18 hours of playtime on it grinding and watching you as I play. Yeah, I mean, it's a freaking great game. I mean, I've got over 110 hours, and that's that's a lot for me. Okay, uh, what do I need next? What was I doing? I don't remember. Oh, yeah, ice cream. All right, let's go back and see what's going on with the ice cream. Gidget, thank you for the super chat. There is a house in my neighborhood two doors down with a mini dojo in their garage with the words um, on the wall, strike first, strike hard, no mercy. It's, oh, that's hilarious, dude. Now, you got quality neighbors, man. Legit. All right, so I think that's a chocolate ice cream. I believe. I can't really tell the difference in the ice cream. I guess I can pick it up. Yeah. Yeah, it's a chocolate ice cream. Let's do a whole order. Set up a whole... Oh, we need coffee. Okay. All right, guys. How many negatives do you think we're getting today? How many? I'm going to say... Eight. Oh, pig hammer. I'm going to say eight. I said it before you say it. Yeah, but I didn't see you saying it. So we both said it, like, independent of each other. Okay, here we go. Eight. 
Oh, 13. Oof. 13. I don't see any 13s. Man, we've missed a lot together today, guys. For real. Oh, can someone write this down, please? Potato. Book, book. Damn it. I think it was these potatoes. Book. I won't share. And vintage storybook. I won't share. Mm, 6.50? Nah, let's go 6.25. I want to stay close to the... Everything keeps going down. Even the books. What the hell? Um, vintage something. Yeah, this one. 9.25. Bleach was the last thing. Ugh, everything... Way too much stuff is going down. Like, I'll get one day where, like, four things will go up, and the next week will be, like, three to four things all going down. Maybe it just feels like that. Uh, 475. Did I get all of them? I think I got all of them. Just look through here really quickly. And there's the bleach. Potatoes. Yeah, and two books. Okay, it's never more than four. Okay, guys. Um, I do think we are going to call this one here. Uh, thank you very much for hanging out with me today. It's not too late to like the video. Uh, thank you for the likes I've already gotten. If you haven't liked, maybe uh, you could like the video right now. Also, this will be up as part 38, so it will be up as a full video part of the series. So you can go back and watch the whole thing if you got here late or you want to just make sure you don't miss anything. And thank you for the super chats. Thank you for joining the Cage crew. I will be back tomorrow. I'm probably just going to play this tomorrow and Saturday. Um, probably no Sons of the Forest. Because I just feel like this would this would get more people. So, um, But who knows? Who knows? I do know I'll be back tomorrow. So... All right, good. Have a... Okay, good. Um, okay, guys. <laughs> Have a good rest of your Thursday night, and I will see you tomorrow. Oh, walk around the block. That's right. Okay. Well, if you're still here, I'll walk around the block. Oh, watch out. Hey, I'm running here. There's my store, and then there's another part of the block down here. This is an interesting looking area. Just so you can see the player will never see most of this because they don't run around it. Alright guys, see you next time.